Hey everybody, sorry for the minute delay there, whatever. Um, hey everybody, it's JJ here, um, and I'm going to show you a tutorial on how to make your own free private server for Minecraft. First of all, just open your browser, and you want to get Halo's mod. Which is what I use. Make sure it's the Minecraft forums. And I already have it, but I'm going to download it again, anyways. Uh, you can read this stuff if you want. Um, just download its latest build. Let it download. Open it. And for this video, I'll create a new folder. Let's name it Minecraft Server. I'll put the links in the description, um, I think, well, whatever, never mind, um, yeah, so just extract your files, open up your folder, and inside your bin folder, double click no server, uh, server no GUI, and Try that again. Never mind. Never mind. Uh, okay. Oops. Close my other server that's running here because that's probably the reason why it's crappy. Try this again. Oh. <coughs> <coughs> okay then. Um, I'm not sure how to run the server without Hamachi, but um, I'm actually relaunched my server recently. Uh, it's brand new, new stuff in it. Uh, it's also with the most recent build here, and what you want is Hamachi. I'll do that right now here. So just in Google, I'll end up giving you the link. Um, search up Hamachi. Make sure it's I clicked the wrong one. Uh, Hamachi. It says Hamachi line download. Then just download it. Download it. There you go. So you download it, open it, um, just follow all the on screen instructions that lead with it. And if you want to create your own, um, your own thing, like your account, it'll tell you like what you what you have to do. For people to access your Minecraft server, you're going to have to go to a network, create a new account, then name it whatever you want, and put the password as 123, or whatever you want again. Whatever you want people to memorize, 123 is the easiest to remember. Um, then just go to create, and then tell people the name of your ID and the password and they will go to join an existing network and again they will type in the ID and the password then join it uh, I can't join it because I already own it because I created it um, and then after that so in case you guys are interested in joining my server the ID is JJ Server one and then the password is one two three. And if I launch up Minecraft, this sh this server should be up currently. So I'll go find myself 
Minecraft. Uh, so much crap open. I like to organize crap. Okay, so launch up your Minecraft. Um, I got the, this is a pirated Minecraft auto updating thing that I got from. Uh, I believe his YouTube name is Angel Kato Zero. Um, just search him up on YouTube and look at his videos. He does not do his server anymore. I think he permanently shut it down. So which inspired me to make my own server but no one joined it so I shut it down and I relaunched it again recently and then type in my IP of Hamachi which is going to be 5 whoops 5 to 11 59 and 226 yeah it should connect Ah, yes, that's right. If you do not own Minecraft, like you haven't bought it, um, and you want to run a server for people who haven't bought it, and if you haven't bought it, to run it for yourself. Uh, hang on. Okay, six minutes. Um, go to, like, look in here, and you want to find server.properties. Um, just make sure you open it with Notepad or WordPad or something like that. Notepad the best, and then you'll notice all this crap here. Um, hell world means if you put in true, you'll spawn in hell. Spawn monsters is well pretty obvious. It spawns monsters. If you don't want monsters, then do that. And this is the most important. If you want it to be offline, for people who haven't bought the game, where it says online mode, put in false. You can choose if you want it to spawn, spawn animals, how many players you want at your server at one time. Um, you can change your IP, but it doesn't really work all that well. I've tried a few things. It says, isn't there a port, uh, something still running on that port, which makes no sense, so I just leave it blank. Um, PvP means you can kill other players or animals and stuff like that if you want. And then this is another good thing. So if you want to make two, IP, uh, two servers on the same IP, uh, 255565, that's the most basic one. And then you can also just go like 6656, six, stuff like whatever. Um, and then plugins, when you download plugins, I'll show you my current server and all the plugins and crap that's on it. But you can download server uh, plugins for Halo's mod, just gotta look on the internet for that. And when you're done, just save. And. Oops. I'm back. Whoa, whoa. Hello. I'm sorry about this, guys. Or Skype. 